that just broke my King Said Dreams heart. Me and Ezra cannot dance because of the stupid dance floor. So when I see you, it's on sight. We're delighted to announce the diamond of the season. Isabella Gonzalez cordially invites you to attend her Sweet 16. How exciting! <laughs> my name is Isabella and this is my King Set Diary. I remember I was seven years old and her name was Giselle and she was on my drinking Kingsingera. Watching her, my Roman Empire, like I was just like, okay, I want to be that girl. I want to have my own quince. I want to share this experience with my family members because I'm the first in my whole family to have a quince. I think we started with um, Enchanted Forest. Too many people have that theme. I, I want to be like the trendsetter. I mean, I've seen like Bridgerton parties, but I've never seen like a Bridgerton quinceanera. Every single year, I had a new theme that I wanted. It, was, it went between Teal to Beauty and the Beast. Finally, I chose Bridgerton because it's a very unique theme. That theme, like that, that's how I present myself to be. Royalty, I have royalty and loyalty. I'm, <laughs> I'm smart, I'm kind, like Daphne. <laughs> I would say my extracurricular is cheer, but I would also like to incorporate like science. I really, really like science. I really like learning about the body. I like to learn about that stuff so one day I could help my family members when they're sick. Helping other people, that makes me feel complete. It brings more happiness to me. I think it's because like I'm always on her. Like I'm always like, Mom, did you do this? Mom, are you, um, did we talk to the photographer? Mom, did we talk to the planner? Instead of bridezilla, like I'm King Sezilla. King Sezilla, I cringe. <laughs> <laughs> if I don't bug her, the job ain't gonna get done. And we get in a lot of fights over that. It's everybody's first time being a parent, everybody's first time being a kid, and I feel like this was our first time being having a King Set. Every single day, Every hour, actually, I would remind her, like, hey, um, did you message the event planner? And I feel I would feel bad sometimes because I knew, like, I would, like, annoy her a lot. But the job had to be done. Yeah, I'm exciting for everything, mija. Everything is exciting for me. All those women at that table, like, they just, like, mean so much to me. My grandma is... She's everything and more like I could ask for. And the other day she told me, she said, Isabella, like I knew it was you. Like I knew like you were gonna be the one. So, sorry to all my cousins out there, but. Yeah, I just remember you were little and you were like six or seven and you're like, I wanna be a princess. And we just started laughing. We're like, what do you mean you're gonna be a princess? Where are you gonna work at? And you're like, uh, duh, Disneyland. <laughs> Last year at school, I, I didn't have the best school year. I didn't have good stability. Even on my bad days, I knew that I could call my Nina. She would be there for me. She would give me advice. You know, she would drop everything just to come to my house and, and to make sure that I was okay. She's beautiful, she's smart, she has people around her, her family's in, like she will always be. Layla, how's your day? Layla, what's going on? How are you? She knows, like she, she's the person who's like, even if you don't want to tell her how you feel, she'll know and I love her because- I'll you know, break it out of her. Always stand up for you and she's so forgiving. So I'm not gonna cry on here, but I just love her. So, I just love her so much. Like she understands like me more than anybody. So she deserves it. <laughs> when I didn't, I wasn't having the best school year. She just taught me to not let people get into my head. And she also taught me to just, to say stuff back to other people. It's hard to say no to your kid. Like you want to be able to, to provide and give them everything they ask for. So I know we fight a lot about it, Bella, but I'm really, truly, truly excited for your party. I know you are. I know you are, <laughs> My mom had two jobs in order to pay 
for my quince. She's done so much for me and my family, and God blessed me with not only a mother, but a best friend. Go squat! One, two, three. <laughs> I gotta experience what a quinceañera experience. Okay. Or else it's gonna pop open. One, two, three. Woo! You're not gonna look like that, I promise you, okay? Try harder, guys. Alright, let's go. My first day of practice for the AC Boys, I was kind of nervous because I didn't know these people. Hello, Mrs. Isabella! How are you? I'm good, thank nice. you. Can How you are you? I'm doing awesome. These are your boys. Introduce yourself. I'm John. I'm Angel. I'm George. I'm Angelo. I'm Hissons. Okay. I want you to tell them about your theme. The theme of my party is Bridgerton. Do y'all know what that is? That's a huge word. <laughs> so Bridgerton is... I usually explain it as very like Victorian, like Mary Antoinette. Like they have a lot of money and they go to fancy balls. They have this thing called the diamond of the season. And the diamond of the season is usually the girl who's the most prettiest, the nicest. The queen pick, the queen picks the diamond of the season. We're gonna do something we've never done before. We're gonna let you choose your main chamberlain. Okay. We've never done this before, ever, ever. So go for it. <laughs> I need your opinion. I need your opinion. Okay. Come, come with me, come with me, okay. And I did not want to go into that studio by myself, so luckily, like, my best friend, she came with me, and that calmed down my nerve. So, you know. This way! That middle oh. one is like OG. Yeah, we don't want to go OG. Mmm. Um. Why? <laughs> 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 No, the, the two. <laughs> two. <laughs> yes. Okay, on the side. Okay, okay. It was between um, Jesus and um, Angelo. One, two, three. We, we pick, pick Angelo. Angelo. There he is. <laughs> perfect, because I was going to pick him for you already. Yeah, perfect. It was meant to be. All right, let's go from the top. Angelo in the middle with Isabella. Layla was like, oh, like he has a good haircut, like he has to fade, like that, that'll look good, like that, that'll look good, like contrast, you know? So I was like, you know, I'm gonna trust you, I'm gonna trust my best friend, so. You're there. I feel special. You feel special? It's not gonna last long, don't worry. Angelo beat Jesus because he had better hair than him. Oh, it sounds very elegant. It's super strange, like. Yeah? So definitely it's gonna be a challenge for all of us because we've never done a full instrumental one. So thank you for that. But we got it, yeah? They don't, they don't sing at all? Huh? They don't sing like at all? No, they don't I'm sing serious. at all. I really like that song because it just talks about how people change. And that's what the song is called. It's called Changes. So you're gonna hold one, two, three, four. You're gonna go rainbow and you're gonna go curtsy. Hi, oh, Lorena, I already love you. I already love this. Ready? And I chose the instrumental because the song with the words is actually really, really sad. Five, six, seven, eight. He go one and two spin towards the back wall. Spin, two, three, four. There you go. Do you feel like his arm's pushing you that way? No, I just no? went the wrong Throw her. Throw her. Throw her. Ready? Okay. And you're going to fly. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One and two. Turn. Da, da, da. Well, she's gonna give you an extra spin. Okay. One spin. So one okay. spin, you're here. Okay. Uh, yeah, are you ready? a dancer? No. What are you? I'm a cheerleader. Oh, you're a cheerleader? Yeah. Can you tell? Yeah. How? I mean, I thought she was a dancer. Why? I don't know, because she dances good. Yeah, I'm teaching her. I'm teaching her good, huh? I liked it because I liked the melody and how it flowed. I relate with it because a lot of my friends and a lot of people that I thought I knew, they changed. One, two, out, spin, rainbow, five, six, seven, eight. Nice, all right, from the top. And then I'll add you guys and then I'll give you guys a little break to talk. I feel like I'm in a movie. I don't know why. I always feel like I'm in a movie. I like to think of life. I'm the main character in my life. Like this is my story my life. I like to live up to that expectation. Cheerleader. So what position do you have? Just positions, right? Uh, yeah, I'm a base, so I like lift them and like throw them. What's your football position? I play running back and linebacker. Oh, okay. Yeah, you know what that is, huh? 
You guys came, you came in all confident. I'm like, oh no, they know each other already. I thought you were a dancer because I saw you looking at them. I'm like, is she dancing that? No. Uh, so you never dance like competition? No, but I've, I've been doing cheer since I was like six or seven. Oh, damn, that's so like, kind of know like how to learn things fast, how to like dance fast. Oh, okay. I'm not just anyone else. I know my stuff, I know what I'm doing, I, I know what, what I want, how I want it. So it honestly made me, like, it boosted my ego a little bit. You're gonna go right leg, and then right leg's gonna cross and you're gonna switch sides with him. So you're only using the right leg. Ready, try slowly go. Triple and pivot right leg, switch sides. Boom, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. just go. Go, walk, 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 yeah. walk. Take a step and then flip. Yeah. <laughs> like that? Yeah, but it's, it's all more smaller. So triple and then just step and switch. Oh, switch. You were like, oh. I like put my Lego. <laughs> yeah. Five, six, seven, eight. Triple and pivot and triple and pivot. Yeah. So that so pivot it's like really is, quick. It's a small step. Step. Okay. Try it again. Ready? Five, six, seven, go. One and two. There you go. There you go. Three Woo! and four. There you go. That was it. Okay. Yeah, did you see that? That's good. Yeah. It was, it was, I know what I'm doing. Alfredo. I know what I'm doing. That was giving Alfredo technique. I know what I'm doing. Ready? I had fun every single practice in Alfredo. Like, he was a huge aspect of the fun. I really liked his ideas how he articulated things. I like how his words on his wall that says if you want to, like you would. That made me feel like more happy because that's like my story here. Best friend? Yeah. I saw that, I saw it. Yeah? That was good, that was do, good. Do we approve? We all approve? So far, yes. Yeah. Good, excited. Good exciting. Ready to see his Amelis dress. It looks itchy, but it's not itchy. <laughs> when I first saw the dress, I saw another girl trying the dress on. The lighting in the store just made the dress look so beautiful. The way it sparkled, it made me feel like, that's my dress. That is the dress that I'm gonna have. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that's my favorite part. I think I'm gonna do that all night. I'm just... <laughs> I liked my dress, I was happy with it, but I just felt like I wish it could would have been better. When we got it, it was like a totally different color from what we tried on. It looked like I had lonjas. It made my like boobs look chueco. I literally cried in the store in front of the workers. Like I was like, this is not my dress. This is not what I wanted. This is not what I pictured. Mom was like, meh. And Tia, Tia, meh. And Tia Rossi was like, mm mm. The reason why I picked the dress was because the color, it matched my skin tone. The lime color did not match my skin tone at all. So I was, it was so sad, detrimental. I, I was so like, that just broke my, my King Said Dreams heart. What they gave me looked nothing like this. I, I didn't have like my dream dress moment. The day of my king set, I felt like, you know when you're so excited for something that you just, the night before you cannot get no sleep, like, that was my case. You would think that I would be so tired the rest of the day and I was not, like I was energized, ready to go, ready to dance, have like the time of my life. Like I was just so excited to, have the opportunity to have a quinceañera and share it with my whole family. When I first saw my saloon, I was literally, I just fell in love. It was everything and more that I could ask for or want for like my backdrop with the pictures of me. It wasn't like exactly what I wanted, but I'm glad my mom picked it out because it looked like better than what I actually wanted in the first place. I really liked how everything, it looked like elegant. Like it fit with my theme very, very well. And one thing that I really stuck out to me was my cake. It tasted so good, up to the cake pops. Everything was just elegant. I didn't take a photo with everyone. It was just, if you wanted to take a photo with me, you could take a photo with me, but 
I was just tired like my cheeks were hurting a lot like my cheek muscles were so like tired from smiling and ready go <laughs> Hi guys, hey, we're eating <laughs> 10 out of 10. <laughs> right, Angelo? Mm -hmm. yeah. Rate it. <laughs> 20 out of 20. Oh, like a 6. Uh, Bro, he said 6 out of 10. He said 6 out of 10, but <laughs> ate his whole plate. <laughs> they honestly brought so much light, and they were like my whole like experience. I will say, if I were to to look back when I'm 80 or 90, and to remember my quince, I remember it by my dances and the AC boys. All right, six, seven, eight, go. <laughs> Wait, you want going? Yes! Come on! Wait, I, 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 I should stop. leave like that. That was good. We're good. We're good. The way we both had our tongue out, <laughs> I was like... Okay. I'm like, yes, Andy, clean fade. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see the fade. I'm Let like, yes, taper. Oh, oh, yeah. stop. <laughs> I'm like guys, I got messed up. I'm Where like, you if you're seeing die? this, I'm like, I didn't get one. I wasn't gonna get one with him. Oh. Give me, per, give, give me, give me pretty ojitos. I know. Stop it. The cut is stop it. <laughs> oh, girl, you look a little, you look a little twisty. <laughs> One, two, three, go. <laughs> I like that was good. Like that? that okay. Was good. I think th it's most good and simple. Up? He wasn't just like my photographer, but he was also like a friend. Like my hair was falling apart. Like he was helping me. Like he is not just like a choreographer. Like he was, he was a hairdresser, a makeup artist. He was a therapist. Like he was everything and more. Seven and one, two, done, done, done. And five, six, seven, and one, two, and five, six, seven, and what's going on? This stupid <laughs> store. Don't go to bleep this out. Because they suck. They messed up the color of my dress. They gave me a horrible Carolina. They, my dress is literally broken. I'm pinned right here. My mom went to go get a bustle on the dress. Why am I using a shoelace? Because they did not give me me and Angelo cannot dance because of the stupid dance floor. So when I see you, it's on site. Oh. I'm gonna F you up. Well, you don't have my back. I got, I got you, girl. girl George. Honestly, my brother was a big help. Like, my brother was just like, let's get hyped, like, let's go, like, it's game time, like, let's go, let's go. I didn't have a dance with my brother, so, I mean, that was just, like, my moment, like, my dance with him, my entrance. And I, I was happy that I got to share my entrance with the person who, honestly, I look up to the most. I felt like I got to be in the moment and realize like I'm finally like I'm here. I'm here at my party. I'm here like I've been waiting for so long for this moment and now that it's finally here like it's kind of sad that like I won't get to experience that ever again. Oh my goodness. I saw my, my hair in my face. I was kind of a little bit confused. I was like, how the heck do I move it? I tried my best to move it out of my face. That's my hair, my crown. <laughs> Should have chose a smaller crown. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't even care because I feel like that's what made it memorable.
Yes, queen. How do you feel? You ready? They're over here. I'm not nervous. Oh, let's go, 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 let's go. I looked up fringe white dress. I saw it, $10. I like it because the whole day like, I was like this. Like I was like moving around and I felt it like um, flowing with me. So. My dance, I feel like, like that was like the highlight of like everything. I wanted to like make a statement. My dances was my art, showing how I am through an action. My family members, they call me like a paisa. I wanted to kind of like incorporate what they call me into my dances. If you truly know me, like you know like when it's time to get down, I'll get down. My mom would call me like instead of like a bridezilla, my mom called me like a quinzezilla. I knew what I wanted, I wanted it. I was gonna let everybody know what I wanted, so let them know. How do you guys feel? Como te sientes? Muy bien. I think we did good. I think we did amazing. Oh, oh girl, you're funny. We ate, we ate. That was, oh. We we ate. Ate. How do you feel? Listen. Are you happy with your dances? <laughs> I'm gonna go dance with the tias. Let's go dance with the tias. I'm thirsty. I'm gonna go put some tias right now. Oh, uh, not the tias. <laughs> All the cheerleaders want you, Angelo. How do you? <laughs> How do you feel about the cheerleaders wanting you, Angelo? I don't know. I'm here with my bestie, Wesley. The one who inspired me oh, the most. Stop. The one who made me me. <laughs> who made you you? <laughs> That's the person I was looking for. Your mom looking for you. Okay, let's Come go on. with my mom. How do you feel about this party job? It's going really good. It's, uh, okay, give a brief explanation of the party. Amazing. Amazing? That's not a brief explanation. JD, my boyfriend JD, that's his name, same okay. JD. At my party, like, everyone was telling him, like, like these guys, like, they're dancing with Bella, like, da da And JD was like, I don't care, like, Who's with her at the house? Not them, me. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh. If I think of JD, like he he stands on business. I know that no other girls me, nobody, nobody can compare to me. No. High school is thumbs down, negative star, negative a million star. And last year there was an incident where people were spreading really bad rumors about me. And it was a really bad rumor that could literally like affect my future. I didn't go to school for like two weeks. I was in a dark, Place. I was just, oh my god, cry. Thinking about it just like makes me like so like um, emotional because if I go to school, these people think that I'm doing things that I'm not like. I'm a really good person. The one person who literally like changed my whole perspective was my boyfriend because he's the one who told me like everything will be okay. He walked me to every single one of my classes just to make sure that I was okay. That meant the world to me. And at that time, like, he, he wasn't even my boyfriend. Like, that made me know that, you know what, he's the one for me. Life's funny like that. You lose one thing, get another one back. You thought you know, but it wasn't no fact. No, no, your whole life, but it was all in that. It was more than a dream. It was everything and more than I could, like, ever ask for. So I, I thank God. My dad says it takes a village to raise a child. So it definitely took a village to have my king says. So I would just like to thank that village. If you would like your king said featured on King said diaries, 
click the link below in the description.